Hello, my name is Federico from Garza Web Design, and today I would like to show the folks over at Dartez Gem and Mineral how to change out a slideshow item. Now, uh, you can see that the slideshow part is rotating from image to image, and this is the one I want to focus on. So I'll hover over here to put this on hold. You can see it's a ha Happy Holidays Christmas ad. Whoops, hold on. And so what I would like to do is I'd like to go ahead and change this out since it's past Christmas and put in a Valentine's Day ad. So I've got a temporary ad I'm going to put in that I just kind of uh, took and we'll use just temporarily just for the purposes of this training session. So let's go ahead and go up to content. So that's the first thing you need to do. So we click content. And here's the manage content screen page. I'm going to go here to Christmas slideshow item and what we're going to do is we're going to scroll over here to the right and click edit and now let's scroll over to the left and you can see uh, the Christmas slideshow item. Here's the image. Uh, we can, the website wants to know whether this is going to go on the front page. It's a simply unique page. It wants to know the order, so you can do it first, second, third, fourth. Um, a link, so if you wanted to go to a web page, so let's say you want to go to google.com, you can do that. Uh, you can go www.google.com. We're going to leave it like that. So let's go ahead and change out this image. But before we do, I want... Valentine's Day slideshow item. So let's go ahead and remove. So you click the remove button and we've removed the picture. So now we need to choose a new one. So we're going to choose file and we're going to go to images. I have this. Uh, these are images I've just pulled off the internet that I use just for training purposes. And we're going to click on one of the pictures and then click open. And there it is, but we need to upload it to the website. So we're going to click the upload button. And there it is. Now uh, we need to crop this to make sure it's the right size. So we click crop. And here we are. Now you can see here in the upper left corner, this kind of tells you what it's going to look like on the website. So as we move this around, you can see in the upper left corner what it's going to look like. So let's focus on this part right here and now what you can do is you can pull this out you can push it in there's a minimum size that you need to do so it doesn't let you go in any smaller than than 740 by 400 so but we can expand this out to whatever we want it to be and uh, what we could do is we could just save it right there if we wanted this is what the picture would look like of course it's cutting off some of the text so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this and just grab that and pull it all the way out since it's there. And I'm going to click Save. So here we are. There's the image. It's up on the website. It's cropped. And now I'm going to use an alt tag Valentine Day Add for loose gemstones. Okay, uh, we want it to keep it on the front page. The fourth in the series is fine. If you don't have a, any kind of text on the image already, you can go ahead and type your own text and the website will overlay that on top of the picture. And then uh, we're going to keep this loose wholesale gemstones. That's the general, that's the page for the general catalog. And you can ignore all this. I just hit save. All right, so this kind of shows us a preview of what the slideshow is going to look like. To see what the slideshow looks like, we can go to the home page. You can either click the logo or the home button. Either one will take you there. Okay, there's the first one. Let's just go ahead and fast forward over. And there we are. And that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, please give me a call or, or shoot me an email. 
Uh, again, this is Federico from Garza Web Design. You have a good day.